Hello everyone, in this introductory tutorial to Wondershare Safe Eraser, I'll be going over how to install and uninstall the program, as well as how to update it, and a little bit about the interface. So to install this program, you simply need to Google Wondershare Safe Eraser, and you should be put to a page similar to this. You can either try it for free and have the trial version, and then pay for it later, or you can buy it now. You can also get it on Mac, I will be using Windows today. So I'm going to go ahead and click on try it for free and it's going to start downloading it for me. So I'm just going to click on the exe file that it downloaded and click on run. And now it's gonna go ahead and ask us to install. I'll just click on install. And it doesn't take very long. It's not a very large program, but it does a lot of stuff for how small it is. Once it's done installing, all we need to do is click on start now and it's gonna go ahead and launch the program for us. It'll take us to a congratulations page online. I'm just gonna minimize that and I already have my version registered, so if you haven't done that already, you can purchase it to register it, and you'll have a full product. So when it starts up, it's going to look something like this. It's going to ask, please connect your device via the USB cable. So I'm going to plug in my device, and you can see it's starting to recognize my device as an Apple iTouch 5, which is correct. And now it's going to go through and make sure my device is recognizable and then make sure it has all the information it needs about it. That's what it's gathering right now. You also want to make sure if you're using an iOS in this case that your device trusts the computer. So make sure you do that. Once it finally loads up my device, it's going to come up with this screen. It's going to have our device on the left side. It's going to have how large it is and how much free space there is. And we're going to have some options right here. We have erase all data, erase deleted files, erase private data, space saver, and iOS optimizer. And in this tutorial series, we'll be going over each of those in depth. Now in the case if you ever have a problem with the program, you might need to update it. So to check for updates, we need to click on this button here and click on check for updates. And it says I have the latest version, which is great. Now if you've decided the program is not for you or you just need a fresh install, all you have to do to uninstall it is go to your programs and features on your Windows version, wherever that may be, and then we'll find Wondershare Safe Eraser and we'll click on uninstall and I'll click on yes to remove everything and it will pop up a web page and start to uninstall the program. And once it's complete it'll say uninstallation successful and that's exactly what we wanted. And that's it for this introductory tutorial. I showed you how to uninstall and install the program and update to the latest version. Make sure you check out the other videos in the series to actually figure out how to use the program.